Hey hey, welcome back to our channel. I'm going to show you I'm going to show you how to create tango effect in an easy and quick way in Photoshop. This effect mostly used in all types of dance sports. First thing first, cut the subject out of the background. You can use pen tool or anything of your favorite tools to separate the subject. As for me, I tend to let Photoshop AI to select the subject for me. It's quite accurate in most cases when it comes to uncomplicated background. Press Shift F6 and add 0.5 pixel or feather after you get the selection. Cut the subject to new layer with Ctrl or Command J. Create a new layer. Use Merge tool. Trend keep at 100%. Adjust burst size at 40 and zero hardness. Pick up Curvature Pen tool, which helps us to create smooth wave line. Start from the hand on top, create a wave around the model. Just click to the next point and the line will automatically bend for you. Super easy. When you're at the end point, double click to finish the wave line. Right click to the line and select Drop Path. Drop down menu in Toolbox and choose Merge. Then confirm. There you go. Next, we'll add motion blur to it. Filter, blur, motion blur. Angle, 46 degree, and distance, 70 pixels. We'll now remove some part of the light in front of the subject to make it like surrounding her. Just click to this icon to add white layer mask to it. Hold Ctrl and click to layer 1 to take the selection of the model. Choose layer mask, pick up brush tool, be shortcut. Ensure foreground color is black and paint on the areas you want to remove the light, just like I did. Create a gradient map adjustment layer to add color to the light. Click here to open gradient editor window. In preset, choose spectrum or any preset color that you like. Then OK. To make the gradient only apply to the line, you have to clip it to the line layer, which is layer 2 by pressing Ctrl O G or for window or command option G for Mac. If you want to change color, Create hue saturation adjustment layer and find the right color which suits yourself in hue tab. Remember to clip it matches as well. Once satisfied, choose layer match of layer 2 and use eraser tool to remove a little bit of light that out of her hand. Alright, how you like this tutorial? Hit like, subscribe buttons, so we have more motivation for launching tutorial in the future. See ya!